Social Plus Africa, showcasing the best. Today is a great day. Uh, we have gathered here today to honor a great man, to honor a true soldier of the Lord Jesus Christ, a tireless general who have traversed the length and breadth of the globe. Uh, for the service of God and for the service of humanity. A man that is recognized all over the world. And um, so I was sent here by the International Communion of Charismatic and Evangelical Bishops through Apostles, ISEBA, with a message that the College of Bishops and the International Episcopal Council take pride in presenting to you Cardinal Professor Joseph Dominion JP this prestigious certificate of meritorious service and 21st century leadership award. In recognition and appreciation of your efficient resource management, visionary leadership, outstanding performance, and visible contribution to the service of God and humanity. This certificate is issued here in Abuja, the sixth day of December in the year of our Lord 2020. And we have affixed and ascribed our Episcopal uh, a seal, signed by the Chief Apostle himself, Dr. Warren Hunter, and myself as the African President. May the Lord God bless you and prosper you, and may you use this as a motivating factor to fire on in the service of God Amen. and to affect your generation positively. Amen. The Lord bless you. Amen. The international community has also asked me to decorate you with the ISEBA Medal of Honor. This is the highest medal in the College of Bishops. Okay, we'll stand for this. So in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, I hereby so decorate you in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. All right, let's smile. <laughs> By the grace of God, I don't base in one nation. I go all over the African nation because of my appointment and my job. So when I came in that Saturday, on Sunday, the Idu youth welcomed me and they gave me the first award I received on Sunday. Wonderful. Yesterday, the Nigeria Youth for Good Governance came here and they gave me this other award. Hmm. So today again, of all the great man of God I've heard about, good things all the way from Florida in America, came back to Nigeria, I heard about him also. Everywhere I go in African country, I heard about him, but I've never met him. I've not been privileged to meet, to meet with him. So it was just yesterday that we, we were connected and we talked. So I'm surprised whether this award was waiting for me. Yeah. <laughs> so I really want to really appreciate the counsel of the bishop and the Archbishop himself who approved my nomination. Because if he did not approve it, it would have not been possible. Again, I want to tell the public or the world that whatever you are doing in your small corner, be faithful to what you are doing and to your God. Because man, the record of man cannot take you to anywhere, but the record of the Almighty God mm. can take you to any level, any level that may, like, like what happened in, in, in the scripture was well, the last message I preached in, in, in Ghana. I preached about Temi. Mean, is this not that was the topic? Mm. When, they saw, when Jesus was speaking, he does not have a, rabbi, a, a rabbical um, education. It, it was not ordained or consecrated. It was not announced. Nobody knew. But when he spoke, <coughs> people around him said, Is this not? Mm. Is this not? Mm. So there are things you do, and God will take you to a place that people will ask, Is this not? Mm. Once again, I appreciate this honor and I make a pledge that I will abide 
to the aim and objectives of this honor because you don't give this kind of honor to any kind of person. No. So we, we must make sure we don't abuse such privilege and such opportunity. Mm -hmm. So in summary, I appreciate the Archbishop. I'm very grateful that I met him for the first time in a very, I can say, diplomatic way. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because it's, an, it's a diplomatic honor mm -hmm. that he has given to me. And I want to appreciate all of you who came around to bear witness and to honor me also.